Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Tamara Kisman here and I hope you're all having a great day. Today we're doing another apartment in city living because I'm obsessed with apartments right now. I'm not ashamed <laughs> to admit it. And today we're doing my dream apartment. If I were to live alone and my apartment was like kind of smallish, <laughs> something I could afford, I guess. And I don't live alone <laughs> in real life, but for this apartment, I thought I did. And I definitely made this look like 100% my taste. Like if I were to design the whole apartment, this is probably what I would make it look like <laughs> as far as Sims goes. And I definitely need you guys to tell me more ideas for different kind of apartments to build or to renovate in the comments because I feel like maybe I'm a little bit stuck in my own style and I definitely definitely need to like branch out, do more stuff. So if you have any certain like styles or like certain kind of sims that I could design the apartments for, tell me in the comments because I would just love to do all different ones. And this one does remind me a little bit of the starter apartment that I just did because it kind of has the same color scheme, but that's just because it's my favorite colors in the whole world. <laughs> so yeah. Um, this is just a one bedroom apartment and it has the kitchen with little dining corner in there and then like the living room is where you come in and then there's one bathroom as well. It's in the fashion district, I think that's where I would like to live if I were to live in San Myshuno and it's very tiny, it's kind of cheap as well for, for the rent. So I thought I would just explain why this is my dream apartment, what I did here to make it look 100% like me. So. First of all, I love white walls. <laughs> I live in Finland and almost all apartments here have white, did I say floors? I mean walls, I think I said walls, yeah, white walls, because white walls are super clean, they just, I don't know, they just make it look super nice, so I put those everywhere, but I do love an accent wall as well, so in the bedroom, behind the bed frame, I made that wall pink, because that's like my favorite color, and I think it looks super cute, so we went for pink there, and then obviously I would have pink sheets and bedding on my bed, so I'm using the pink bed from the base game, I think. And I really, really love the idea of having shelves above your bed with like picture frames on them. I would probably put like a picture of, I don't know, <laughs> me and my boyfriend, but I wouldn't have a boyfriend here if I was living alone. But something on there, and then just some cute candles all over the place, and some so just some really cute like paintings that or like pictures that I like got from Tumblr or something, I would put those on the wall because I think they're cute and I kind of, I really like the Tumblr style of home decor. So I don't know, those are kind of what I was thinking about for the pictures on top of the computer area. Obviously I would have a computer, I would put it in the bedroom so it would have its like own private room. It wouldn't just be in the living room. So I would have a computer to play Sims on and then a cute little bookshelf. I have like honeycomb shelves in real life. So I, I, I didn't want to use the ones from <laughs> the kids room stuff back because they're huge, but I used this, diff this like one from base game because it kind of like has fun angles on it as well. And then I'm just trying to find some cute white <laughs> like framed paintings that have like pink stuff on them. And I try these mirrors. I don't remember if I leave them there. I think I might. I think they're super cute. And I do love some lamps as well. Pretty simple ones. I don't want to go overboard. And I definitely love plants everywhere. So <laughs> I just pop those all over the place. And some um, flowers as well. And <laughs> you might have seen I put that little, little stuffed toy there on the ground I don't know I'm just a sucker for cute stuff I love plushies I love all that kind of stuff even though I am 23 so I put two of those in this apartment just to represent that side of me I guess I don't know if you guys want to see me do like a super big dream apartment like one of the multi level ones in uptown tell me in the comments because I could do one but it would obviously be like similar in colors and styles to this one and obviously I have to use my favorite plant ever right there in the corner because it's the best ever and then I use these hanging plants which I love they're like my favorite thing ever I want to have those in real life and I have something like that on our balcony so I use those hanging plants all over this kitchen as well and he has white counters because I really like the look of that and yeah I made the floorboards kind of grayish looking I'm not sure if they look more white here but they are gray and I do prefer gray floors over white ones <laughs> currently I have like brown flooring which I'm not that huge of a fan of but that's what just what you get in most of the apartments here but I do really love the look of like new looking gray like wooden floors I think they look great I don't know I'm just like I feel like 
I don't even know what I want to talk about. <laughs> I, I mean, I'm a bit tired today. I have been working still and I still have four days left of work before I get a day off. So my weekend has just been work, work, work all the time, <laughs> but that's okay. Um, I also downloaded Stardew Valley because I thought I would have, because I don't have that much time to play right now. So I can't really start any huge builds because I did pre-record these. So I'm okay for videos, but I, <laughs> I bought Stardew Valley and downloaded it. I'm having kind of... A lot of fun playing it so if you have any tips for stardew valley as well you might not because you're watching a sims video but if you do feel free to tell me in the comments like what i should do as a beginner i'm still in the spring like the first season of the game for me and i have not really watched any videos on it so i'm learning as i go but it's really fun anyways back to the apartment i'm sorry <laughs> i made this little corner here by the huge windows where i put the dining table with two pink chairs and some flowers there and then i used the cute wall clock as well from kids room stuff pack that has the little plushy dude on it <laughs> it's super cute and then i just really wanted to use this huge curved tv from city living because it is beautiful <laughs> even though it's a bit 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 big for this place because um this it takes like half the room <laughs> but I still wanted to use it and then we just used this really pretty pastel couch that has lots of cute throw pillows on it from movie hangout and then some pouffe chairs as well because I really like those I think they're super cute obviously I have to add some plants and I have the gaming console and then on the other side of the room I'm gonna put the little I don't know what you would call that chair it's like an egg chair kind of <laughs> in my opinion because I think those ones are cool oh and I did oh yeah 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 I went and added these pictures in here they're for like from the kids room stuff pack but whatever i think they're cute i love having pictures hanging out like that i'm, I'm planning on doing a polaroid <laughs> thing like that in real life from pictures from like polaroid pictures that i have taken to put them on display like that in real life so i thought i would do it here as well even though they're pictures of kids and i'm not a kid but you get my point <laughs> And then we just have some lots of cute pink stuff around i think i'm trying to find something i'm not really sure what i'm looking for Oh, I'm looking for this item, <laughs> the little lemons. Yeah, it was super hard to find for some reason. And I do love frogs as well. I have a lot of cats, so frogs are important to put on the floors so the cats don't scratch all the floors or like when they run around, they ruin the floors. So we need to have some rugs in there. <laughs> if we had cats in Sims 4, I would definitely have put three in here because I, I mean, no apartment is perfect <laughs> without cats in it, in my opinion. And here we go, putting this another plushie in, and then I'm putting the egg, egg chair, I'm gonna call it an egg chair, in the other corner, because I think it's cute, and I would like, love to have one of these chairs in real life. Um, I'm trying a few other ones. Which one is it? This one? I don't know, it kind of reminds me of an egg. <laughs> And then we just have the bathroom left, and the bathroom is white and pink as well. And I really, really love those hanging pot plants in like underneath the cabinets in the kitchen. I think that's the coolest thing ever. And I would like grow some herbs in there or something. And that, I don't know, I think that would be a really cool thing to have. If you want to download this apartment, I will put it on the gallery. I haven't put it there yet. Oh no, I don't even know if I've put the park on the gallery yet. Oh, I'm so bad. I will put them there, I promise, <laughs> at some point. The, you can find this apartment on the gallery under my origin ID SimmerKittenYT or under the hashtag SimmerKitten. Also, for some reason, my computer is like overheating a little bit right now, so sorry if you can hear some background noise. But I uploaded iMovie and it's working a bit weird right now, so that is why. But this is the bathroom. I love to have a bathtub, which I don't right now, but I love bath bombs and like candles and candles in the bathroom and I would love to have a bathtub so I put one in there but I need to have a shower as well because if you want to just take a quick shower you can't do that in a bath and then we have a cute little round mirror and a white toilet and then some pink towels everywhere and that's it that's it for you guys I hope you enjoyed this build here are the screenshots of it it's just really cute girly pink and pastels everywhere with white walls and I don't know I think it looks really a lot like me and what I just like personally and I hope you guys like it as well if you did like it don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up I would appreciate it a lot and also subscribe to my channel if you haven't already you're totally welcome to the Kitten family and leave all your suggestions down below in the comments if you have any suggestions for future videos or builds or anything you want anyways I hope you're all having a great day and I will see you soon for another video Bye bye